Hey everybody, we're playing some Pokemon. We gotta make it to the top of the tower to fight Corinna for like the third time. Only those who have been approved may climb the tower. Oh, you may pass. Okay, um... Do we not have to fight people here? I was under the assumption that we fight people. So do you know the Mega Evolution Guru's real name? It's Gherkin. <laughs> Long ago, a trainer came to this land occupied by Lucario. They found two strange stones. This is said to have led to the world's first mega evolution. Yeah, I don't know why I assumed this would be like a battle tower. This is not a battle tower. It doesn't seem like it. Um, okay. Something about mega evolution. It's apparently Descender, the first trainer to evolve Lucario to its mega evolution. Okay. When he was younger, Professor Sycamore trained here to learn about Mega Evolution, but he decided he didn't, he didn't have what it takes and left fairly quickly. Since you were kind enough to come clear up here, I want to you to have this. Low sleep. Sleep. Low sleep. Low sweep. It just is not. Maybe the fact that people think up all of these ways to bring out the power of Pokemon is a message to us to look for all the possibilities everywhere. I... All right, big door. I really love this place. When I'm here with my Pokemon, looking at the wide open sky above, all my worries disappear. And I feel like I can do anything. Thanks for coming all the way up here. It was decided that this must be the place where the Mega Ring is handed over. Something about making sure we never forget to set our sights as high as the sky. And here it is, your very own Mega Ring. It's in the shape of a bracelet, so it's super easy to wear. Left wrist? Why on the left? I'm right-handed. So I, I mean, I guess it'd be easier then, because I could go like Ben 10 this and... Wait. You know. Give your Pokemon the right Mega Stone and try battling with it. Pokemon will surely answer the call of the Mega Ring. Lucario, what's wrong? Oh, yikes, dude. Lucario, are you sure? You want to battle alongside that trainer? Don't know what to say. I'm a bit shocked that some traveling trainer seems to have a stronger bond with you than I do. Well, he must be something special. So what do you say, trainer? Will you and Lucario battle against me and my Lucario? Lucario and Lucario battle will be nothing short of riveting. They both have Lucario night in hand. How about we get this show on the road? I can feel Lucario's passion. Perhaps it's just that it doesn't want to lose to the other Lucario, but it may be that it's just on the same wavelength as you. Dude, that's kind of gnarly though. Lucario versus Lucario. Ready, Lucario? Let's give it all we got. Alright, let's do it. You are challenged by successor Karina. Not gym leader, but successor. Right, let's go ahead and do our first mega evolution here. Our own Lucario. We already have a Riolu, funny enough. So this is just kinda like um extra, but real quick, let me check something. Okay, we're good. Um how do I do the thing? Oh, there it is. Oh, okay, Mega. And let's use, uh... uh power up punch, why not? Lucario's Lucario Knight is reacting. Here we go. Very cool, he now has dreadlocks. Alright, they are also Mega Evolving. Mega Lucario versus Mega Lucario. Are we both level 32? <laughs> oh. Lucario's attack rose. Yeah, we both are level 32. So, am I just slightly faster? So, I just win because I'm just slightly faster? What happens if I lose? 
you defeated Corinna. What an incredible bond you have. What an amazing power. What an explosive battle. I could tell that both Mega Lucario didn't hold back anything. With strong bonds like that, you shouldn't have any problem triggering your Pokemon's Mega Evolution. I think it would be best if you took that Lucario along with you on your journey. It's quite apparent that you two make a truly incredible team. Lucario is staring intently at David. Will you take Lucario with you? Of course I will. What do you mean? Okay, um... Side duck can screw off just for a minute. Alright, we will receive Lucario. Again, I have a Riolu, but hey, it saves me from having to evolve it, so. Give a nickname? Nope. As long as Pokemon and Trainer have the kindness to care for each other and give each other courage, the world will be full of smiles. Alright, well, this tower was much easier than I thought it was. Um. Yeah, I thought I was going to have to battle like seven people to get up here. Um, also, real quick, let me make sure this isn't a door over here. Okay, I thought that might have... It looked like a door, but it's just a window. Okay, well, now... Are we technically done with Shalor City? I think we're actually done with here. So, I think we can move on to Route 12. Because we got the gym, we got the mega stuff. So, I'm pretty sure we're good to go. Um, let's see. Okay, so we gotta search for the stones. Okay. Alright, well then, let's go ahead and get out of here. Um, we're kind of chilling. Now, actually, I really do want to keep that Lucario with me. But, once again, our, our goal here is to get the Pokedex. So, I'm actually going to put it back. Um, because, once again, I need that slot open. Um, so Lucario, I thank you. But, let's put him in the battle box, how about that? So we kind of signify him as a special Pokemon. But right now, I need Pokemon that I can evolve. So we're gonna go ahead and grab Psyduck back. And maybe we'll use Lucario when we get to the Elite Four or whatever. Um, but I think that's kind of it. So if we go back to Shaler City. Um, let me double check that I didn't miss anything. So with an old rod, we can get a love disc, which we already have. Okay. Um, it's time to go to Route 12. And then after Route 12, we go to the city that I've been waiting for to get that stupid good rod. Hey neighbor, you should use this. That's where we get surf. I was wondering where we get that from. If you use surf, you can travel over the water. When I think about it, it's kind of amazing how a person like you came to Kalos and ended up traveling with me. It's like destiny. Okay, well that is instantly going on Greninja. Because Surf is 90 power. So, yes, so that is instantly going on Greninja. And we are going to be forgetting. Round is 60. Deck is 40. Well, we're never going to use uh, Water Pulse above Surf, so we can just get rid of that. It has 5 less PP, but that's fine. All right, cool. Very, very cool. Keep moving on here. I think we already talked to most of these people, so we're kind of we're kind of chilling here. Ooh. Okay, dude, just talk to me. This kind Lapras here once saved me from drowning. I feel bad though. I cannot afford to travel around it and show it the. Uh, wide world. Hey, I've got an idea. You've got a rumble badge. You must be a strong and seasoned traveler. Would you mind taking Lapras with you on your journey? Dude, we really have to... Alrighty. Let's go back. Put Psyduck away. Grab the Lapras. Run back. Put the Lapras away. But I do want to grab this Lapras, though. Is this from you? Cool. Thank you for your Lapras. Um, sadly, I, um, have a Greninja, so, 
Yeah, so I will not be traveling with you all over the world. I'm going to be sticking you in the box, which I'm actually... I've never felt sorry for a digital creature before, but in this case, I do kind of feel bad. Because I just told the guy, yeah, I'll take your Lapras around the world with me, and then I'm just like, huh, psych. Um, I'm just gonna stick it in my box. Um, what are you gonna do? You know, what are you gonna do? Let's go back to Route 12 and actually start doing what we were doing here. A few Pokemon to catch. We got Slowpoke, Chatot, Execute, Tauros, Miltank, Pinsir, and Pachurisu. Um, is there anything back here? Do I have a Pokemon with Cut? Currently, I do not have a Pokemon with Cut. Who can learn Cut? Esper can learn Cut. Alright, Esper. Maybe you are useful for something. Yes. Let's go ahead and get rid of... Light screen, yeah. You're not gonna need light screen right now, Esper, so... Let's go ahead and give it cut here. Yes, Esper, go ahead and cut it with your tiny little claws. Yeah. Alright, berry. An Asper berry. Very cool. Worth the cut? Probably not. Um, I don't know if we should just... Oh, the rest of this is water, isn't it? Okay, so that's all water. What over here? Okay, that's all water. Well... Ooh. No, what, what do you gotta say? Everything... Okay. Well, then let's stay here. And catch some Pokemon that we need. Um, so we have quite a few... Wingle is surprisingly not one that we need. Um, so, the one that we need from Hordes is actually Mareep. Um, oh, and from Surfing, we can actually find Lapras, which is a 1%. So I guess if we didn't want to do one from the guy, we could find one there. And then, just another Love Disc from the from the old rod, but we, again, we are getting the... Why did you crit, you big dummy? Don't do that. Why would you crit? Luckily, Chatot isn't one of the rare ones. It's a 30%. But still, bro, come on, man. Alright, Slowpoke, another one of the um, not rare ones here. Alright, Greninja, please do not crit this time. Okay, disable. Oh. What am I gonna hit you with now? Alright, that's fine. Let's throw a great ball at you. Hopefully it does what it needs to do here. Kinda wasted that quick attack, but I think we'll be fine. Let's go, dude. Slowpoke was caught. Didn't even need to do anything nuts with it. It always vacant. It's always vacantly lost in thought, but no one knows what it's thinking about. It's good at fishing with its tail. And surprisingly, its tail is not that long, so I don't know how it's a good fisher with it. But um, fair enough, I guess. All right, give me a chat tot. No, <laughs> Just another slowpoke. Yeah, so far. And I'm sure you guys saw it kind of in the last one. Sometimes I just get new Pokemon after new Pokemon, getting caught first ball. You know, I can catch like six in like a minute. Sometimes it gives me a chat tot, I kill it, slow poke, I grab it, another slow poke. It's like a another slow poke. Come on, man. I I'm trying to catch these Pokemon fast. Giving me a bunch of slow pokes and killing things is not particularly my speed here. Yo, is Heracross an exclusive? Bro, you gotta be kidding me, right? Um, yeah. Apparently, Heracross is an exclusive to Pokemon Y. What? Really? And apparently, Pinsir is an exclusive to Pokemon X. The really weird part... Dude, you gotta be kidding me. 
The weird part is, Heracross is much, much better than Pinsir. So I don't understand why Pokemon Y gets like the really, really good bug Pokemon and we get the eh bug Pokemon. Um, please give me something that's not, okay, good. Actually, this is the one of the rare spawns in this area, so that makes me happy that it gave me five slow pokes and then the rare. Don't kill. Okay, good, good. Don't blast me with some stars. Still some great balls. Just because it's the rare, we might as well. One. Oh, crit. Okay, there we go. Ba -ba 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 -bum. What's the odd Pokemon of the bunch here? I think that's the same Pokemon. It makes fur balls electricity something something. I totally accidentally clicked yes before I was done reading that. Alright, so we got the first and last Pokemon. So now we need the five in the middle. Pinsir, Miltank, Tauros, Execute, Chatot. Miltank. That is another one of the rarer ones at a 10%. So pretty cool. Also, one of the Pokemon is going to have a little bit of higher HP and defense, so I'm pretty cool with hitting it with a round. Yeah, milk drink. Okay. Is this, like, perfect to get it in the red here? What did it just do? Yes, it is perfectly in the red. Um, so that milk drink actually helped quite a bit there. Alright, so now... Ooh, no shot. Um... I'm actually gonna throw a Premier Ball at it. I don't know why, I just really want a milk tank and a Premier Ball. Oh, you butt cheek. Oh, that's gonna hurt. That hurt a lot. Um. All right, come on, Mel Tank. Don't don't be that one Mel Tank from I think Gen Two. Milk drink? No, don't drink your milk. Why would you do that? Because now you're in the. Gr All right. Well, we just gotta keep throwing balls. If I hit it with another pound, I'm gonna kill it. I could hit it with a quick attack, but. What are you... This mill tank, man, on another level. It's escaped so many balls, it's insane. Well, and we will have to go back and, uh... Heal. And also, I'm probably gonna have to go buy more great balls. One. Two. Three. No! Why? Don't do that. Oh, I'm wasting so much money on a single mill tank. I hate mill tank so much. I'm not gonna even count. Let's go, dude. After like six great balls, we got it. Yeah, Esper got a big old level there, though. Bum, 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 bum. Um, when does Esper, 25, okay, if it is around babies, the milk it produces contains much more nutrition than usual. Very cool. What do you guys think? Should I take a, um, should I take a milk tank into the Elite Four? Maybe? Alright, Chad Tot. Um... Here's the thing, I don't want to run back before I evolve Esper very quickly, so let's go ahead and try to catch a few more, evolve Chata, and then we'll go back to heal. Because uh, I don't want to run back twice. Okay. Thank you, Chata. See, that wasn't that bad. So now we just need Execute, Tauros, and Pinsir. And, um, Pinsir's that 5%, so that one's going to be a little rough. Um, we'll, we'll, we'll get it. It may make surprise of other Pokemon to trick them into thinking it's one of them. This way they won't attack it. Very cool. Bought a lot of chat on, on, uh, 
go fest. So we have both of the Pokemon from Rock Smash. And then from Hordes, we just need the Mareep. And that's it. I think... Okay, we can get a Tauros. It's another one that I think we need. Did we get the Tauros? No, we didn't get the Tauros. We can get that out of Hordes, too. I don't think I want that one out of a Horde. And then we'll have some Surfing... Okay. Hopefully we can get lucky, we can kind of get a Marie Horde while we're doing this. Or unlucky, because I don't have Greninja Live with him at that point, just revive it and call it a day. Man, what's with all these Slowpoke? Can y'all get out of here, man? I don't, I don't need you guys. There's, it's supposed to be a 30%. There's way too many of you. I've gotten them at least like 60% of the time. Your odds are too high. Go away. No, not another mill tank, dude. I was looking for uh, someone else. I don't need your milk right now. Is there yellow flowers around here? Because in yellow flowers, it's much easier to find Tauros. Never mind, I found it here, so... Never mind, I guess that don't need to do that. Tauros is Intimidate. Alright, let's go and start chucking Great Balls. Again, I know it's really not the best strategy here. I should probably weaken it, but... Um... I doubt Esper's gonna be able to do a lot of damage to this Tor to this Toro. All that blows quite a bit, actually. All right, well, looks like we're going back. Um. All right, <laughs> cool. Sure, Toros. Just uh, smash my Esper. Fine. I'm just gonna. Oh no. All right, look. Keep throwing him. I'm not gonna weaken it right now. I don't have Greninja on me. This is gonna be a hard catch, isn't it? Why do you use Why do you use Payback? That move hurts. Don't do that one. That move hurts. Okay. Too nervous to eat berries. Well, that's wonderful. He's shivering in his boots. He can't eat berries or sleep. He's crying. Hello? Let's go, dude. Alright. He was quaking in his boots, so he stayed in the ball. Alright, so Litleo to 20. I need an Esper to 24, but that's okay, I guess. Okay. After heightening its will to fight by whipping itself with its three tails, it charges at full speed. Alright. That's a little weird, bud, but hey. Am I too am I really gonna use a revive here? No, I'm not. No. I'm gonna go back. I'm I gotta not be lazy here. My you know, that revive money can get me a couple of Pokeballs, so I will not be lazy. Let's just go and heal. Oh, hey! Uh, there's an ice cube! Cool. That is the one that I was looking... One of one of the ones that I was looking for. Going to hit it with a quick attack. Right in the eggs. No, don't do that. You don't... You don't need to do that. Why would you poison me? That wasn't very nice of you. Um... I was like almost about to throw a luxury ball, and I'm like, no, you don't deserve luxury. You poisoned me, you disgusting pile of eggs. Why would you do something so heinous? Especially you in the back with your yolk sticking out. That's indecent. Don't do that. That's gross. Least you could do is stay in the ball. I'll make scrambled eggs later. I love scrambled eggs. Some salt on it. A little paprika. No, not paprika. Uh, black pepper. 
Get some tomatoes, some onions, a little bread. You know, you know. hey, yeah. It's six eggs. It's six eggs converse using telepathy. They can quickly gather if they become separated. Gross. All right, we're just looking for pincer now. Last one. So we got Patrisu, Meltank, Tauros, Execute, Chat Out, Slowpoke. Hey, Patrisu. Rare spawn, but I don't need ya. I already got you. And then after we get the pincer, we just need the Mareep out of hordes and we're all set, basically. Oh, hey, okay, there is the pincer that we were looking for. Very nice. Go ahead and give the disgusting bug a little quick attack. Bop. Alright, break, break. That's gonna hurt. Um, okay. Now, Greninja, do not crit for love of... And it... I'm actually, like, I'm pretty, like, angry about that one. I specifically asked to not crit. I specifically asked. What is a crit percentage? Crit percentage in Pokemon. Six... Six percent. Six percent. I ask it not to crit. And it crits. Sh sure enough, it crits. Wonderful. Wonderful. It grips its prey with its pincers until the prey is torn in half. What it can't tear, it tosses far. Ugh. Okay. Well, that is technically... Oh, we still need... We still need, uh, Mareep, right? Wait, why did I just do that? I need Mareep and Hordes. Um, okay. Let's go ahead and do a few horde battles and hopefully we can grab ourselves a Mareep here. We still got... We don't got Vileplume with us. Do we still have the honey? Maybe we can just kind of get lucky? Do we have one honey with us? Do we have one honey? Do we really not have it? Oh, no. Do we have sweet scent as a, a thingy? Okay. I gotta go grab Vile Plume. I'll be right back. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me go ahead and evolve Esper first. So let's go ahead and surf and we can catch a few Pokemon while we're surfing. Nope, didn't mean to do that. Yeah, let's go ahead and catch a few Pokemon while we're surfing. That way we can evolve Esper, then grab Vile Plume. Alright, Tentacool. So there's only two Pokemon here, Tentacool and Mantyke. Now, um, the Mantyke is going to be 15%, so it's going to take a few surfs to find it. Well, we're going to need another Tentacool anyway, so that's fine. Because we killed the absolute poo, poo out of this one. Nope. Alright, come on. Tentacool just, uh, I've actually got friends that want to play games with me right now. So if you just want to stay in the ball, that would be kind of wonderful in the moment, to be honest. We got a new comment. Mm. Okay. Oh, hey, we got it. I'm like, sorry, I got a text, an email, a YouTube comment. And an invite to play games. Its body is virtually composed of water. Shoot streams beams from its crystal eyes. I got a, I've got a bunch of things just thrown at me all of a sudden. I got to read this email. Yes, we have. All right. 
Um, alright, um, here is Mantike. I was literally in a Discord call with my friends because they want to play games like now. So I'm gonna quickly catch this. And then we might, um, call it a day here. Just gotta quickly catch this. Alright, come on. Alright, Mantike, please. Come on. I, I got places to be. Mantag is gonna make me have an aneurysm. Dude, just stay in the stupid ball, dude. Alright, I'm gonna quick attack. If I kill it, I'm just gonna have a meltdown. Okay, don't recoil yourself to death, please. Oh lord, it's gonna end up killing itself. Alright, please, Mantag, for the love of the lord. Stay in the ball. No! Is it gonna kill itself? Okay, it didn't. Dude, this Mantike is definitely gonna be like the end of me. Like, this is the one moment where I need the Pokemon to be fast. Come on, man. Like, I got places to be. And this. Oh, this Mantike is making me so angry. Dude, please just. Stay in the ball, I got somewhere to be. Dude, come on, please, Mantike. Thank you, holy. I now have a pretty strong hatred for Mantike, by the way. That was definitely one of the harder Pokemon to catch so far in the game, and this was just not the right moment for it. So I definitely, I had now have a vendetta against Mantike. The pattern on its back varies by region, often swims in a school of remorade. Alright, I want, I'm gonna, I really want to nickname you as Butthole, but we'll leave you alone. Okay, so right now, all we need left, because we got the Tentacle of Mantike, we got the Lapras, we just need that more report, but we're gonna go ahead and do that next episode, because right now I need to go, because people are waiting for me. So I'll see you guys next episode.